About 65,000 years ago, the bow and arrow was invented in Africa. This device would change how people hunted for the rest of time, but only 64,400 years later in ancient China during the Zhou, Zhao, Zhao, how do you pronounce that? Zhou. Okay, the, um, the, the Zhou dynasty, around 500 to 600 BC, the crossbow was invented. Um, this new form of artillery was a lot more advanced than the bow and arrow. The crossbow, instead of using a string connected to the two ends of the stick, which is actually called the limb, it used a cord which you pulled back and connected to the back of the crossbow to lock it in place. This, unlike the bow and arrow, allowed you to easily keep it loaded for extended periods of time without having to hold it back with your hand and hurt your hand. This slightly unrealistic creation of uh, how a crossbow loads was done in Half-Life, which is a game that came out in 1998. Um, as you can see from this example, the cord gets held in place, and it builds up tension with the bolt, and whenever you want to fire, you pull the trigger. Now, um, here's a fun fact. Uh, the crossbow actually uses bolts instead of arrows. Bolts and, like, arrows are pretty thick and usually made of a metal with a pointy tip. This slightly unrealistic recreation shows how the crossbow was used to defend forts because of how accurate and powerful it was. The crossbow was also used for long-range battles, since it was a lot more powerful and more accurate than the standard bow and arrow. Um, fun fact, the crossbow can actually shoot up to 500 yards. The knock it down! Well in the chest! Not good enough! Good enough! Nowadays, crossbows are being mass-produced and are likely being sold at your local Dick's Sporting Goods. These modern crossbows are also used for athletic competitions, hunting, or as an antique. As you can tell, the real crossbow has really changed over the years, such as adding a scope for easy aiming and seeing targets from long distances. The crossbow used to be very simple and looked like this, but today it looks like this. This infamous weapon has also made an appearance in quite a few video games, such as the Half-Life series, Gary's Mod, Far Cry 4, PlayerUnknown's Battlegrounds, Age of Empires, and Team Fortress 2. There you go. Morning. Just as like a reference, this is how long it was. I was all the way standing right there, and I hit him from all over there. Who's shooting me? Who's shooting me? Where you at? Where you at? There you are. Very nice.